Hello everyone, it's me, the Shadow World One, and I am back with God of Game Productions on the commentary for Salvation 4. Phew! And you know, he cut me off the last time. What the? Oh, whoops. At the last part, I had something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm evil. Sinister. You're not that evil. Jerkerish. <laughs> okay, that, that was just... That's my that... visa laugh. I love to do my visa laugh. Honestly, I do. Yeah, I kind of figure that out. Yeah, I should have done that for our... Joker, right? You know, I think, um... What? Therizan's battle... Therizan's no, no, no. Therizan's voice, there was, like, crickets in the background. Uh, I think that was... I don't know what Shadow Gear was doing when we were recording the lines, because I... Could, he couldn't send the lines to me for some reason, so... We had to rec I just... Yeah, I like how Therizan's, like, old self was back there. Well, that was just... A, that was just what his people looked like without all the armor. That was so just you mean that wasn't Therizan? That wasn't Therizan. That was a innocent life I, getting I don't killed. Know why... that was, you saw the shot in the chest? I mean, that yeah. was the chest. That was in... Yeah, I don't <laughs> know why Therizan's, like, mask is all dusty in this sequence. I think he cleaned it off, right? No, because he's a war veteran. I mean, pretty much he's been through a ton of crap. And then Lax and Nulez, he, there's a lot of uh, more... A lot more compassion in this. And um, for a spoiler, um, Salvation 5 will mainly focus on Lax's story. And his past, and you'll learn... Don't don't say anything. I won't. No. Okay. Okay. And uh, this is pretty much we tell we learned that Lax was an assassin. I mean, you know that. Well, that you know. Well, that we, he's an assassin. That you, you think you know. You, you think you know that he's an assassin, but, but he. The rest it's of it a lot more be, complicated than that. Yeah, the rest will be told in Salvation Five. Yeah, and then Lulez's voice was done by in Nickelord, who did an amazing job. He had a lot more, more uh, feeling to it. I mean, you learn that their people were struck by Baxter's forces like out of the conquest first it's kind of sad and then you learn that kelgar was a scholar like a really really big talented scholar i mean he was like he had knowledge is like a weapon yeah i really like kelgar's character i mean he's sort of like the brains of the group yeah he's kind of, well he's really he's really wise just noble he's a he's an amazing fighter i mean he he can stand up to Baydak alone. Well, well, kind of. Kind of. I mean, I mean, for a couple seconds, maybe. <laughs> probably, probably. Uh, I don't know if he, if Baydak's arms are all chopped off. Well, I mean, Baydak is a lot more tougher now. In, in, oh, uh, like I think it was Salvation Two or Three. 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 Um, well, they, they like they he all fight all him. Four, he challenged all four of them at once, and he just <sighs> sent them away. Uh, I believe I should upload the updated version of Salvation Three because I updated it, made it better. Uh, just take the original one off and then put your no. New I'll off? just uh, the better version of it. Yeah, I'll just yeah. leave the other one though. Yeah, and we have the eleven <clears throat> leaders of the resistance. I'm not sure. There's one. I think you can see if you look really closely, you can see a spigot, and you can see like one that looks like Kel Akar. Yeah, I don't think you should have added Volta as the character. For well, Al's actually, app. Volta is a reincarnate. I mean, the staff made Volta used to be a total of magnetism. Then the staff, when he helped, he touched him, I mean, it changed his, what he looked like. It changed, took his powers away, and it made him look like Alzav. Well, that's kind of weird. Oh, I like that. Oh yeah, made Baxter's thing. eyes. You know, and he sent the staff into the space. Well, Baxter isn't created yet, so yeah, yeah. We can't tell you anything about that. That's top secret. Classified. Classified. I don't even know it yet. Yeah. Mia, do I? How weird. How is that classified then? If neither of us know it. What? Never exactly. mind. Okay, then we have, like, Volta asking, like, he wants to become leader of the Resistance, which Thurazon gets pissed at, off at. Well, and, obviously, man. I mean, he's been there a long time. He's been there for a long time. I guess he doesn't like, like, a rookie coming in and trying to rough his way yeah. up to the head point, man. Yeah, and he gets, he gets mad. And I mean, Thurazon like, likes to be, like, the head honcho around. Yeah, he's, he's kind of, he's, out of the 11 leaders, he's been kind of, like, the leader of the 11 leaders, but, and... They're kind of, they're like, two, Kelgar and Therizan are like two of the most respected. I mean, are we going to show um, one of the newest leaders in Salvation 5? Like, I mean, do you want to no, throw one yet. of them? No, not yet. It's just going to be focusing on the new Bounty Hunters. The Bounty Hunters, yes. And I believe you already told our forum about the names. Yes. They know who the, the names of the new Bounty Hunters. Well, if they've been paying attention. I mean, hopefully they'll... Hopefully they have been paying attention. Because we don't want any idiots. We got a lot of... Uh, don't call people idiots, you <laughs> fool. It's not very nice. That's the reason why people hate you. The reason, I'm just, I'm just hey, joking. you're calling me an idiot. I'm just joking. 
Oh yeah. Oh, here comes the duel for leadership. You know what? Yep. I'm not sure that Therizon's really the sword type. Well, yeah, but he's more of a gun type. Oh, here comes the epic battle sequence. You know, I think Kelgar had a better fight sequence. Oh, yeah, definitely. That, I'm so surprised we got that on one shot, all of that. Yeah, that that spinning blades part, we yeah. actually tried that in um, live action, but it didn't work out uh -huh. so well. And then here comes the boom. Throws on punches him in the face. And then you this know, I still wanted you to do sparks when his blade went across his staff. Yeah, that would have been take, that wouldn't taken too long. I mean, I wanted to get the scene done as quickly as possible. I was thinking about doing a big burst of light when Therizon gets hit here, but that it just that'd be like cheating, yeah. almost. No powers Meaning here, no skills. And then Volt Therizon is finally defeated honorably, and he like accepts that Volt has. I mean, leader. he doesn't like the idea of it, but I mean. And some people were really pissed off that for some reason that uh, Volt <laughs> became leader. I don't know why. I mean, this has been my plan from the very beginning. Yeah, from the very beginning, I w he w he was going to become a leader of the resistance. I mean, you still have to fight all the rest of the leaders, and I'm not sure. I think that's probably going to be a spoiler too. Well, I'm not sure. I'll have to see when we get up, get there. I mean, it, once we get past uh, five and six and yeah, seven well, and eight, nine, ten, ten, eleven, twelve, 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 twelve. Okay, calm down. Well, a lot of you people have been saying, um, "Do you think that Therizon's going to somehow join Baxis?" I'm going to no, tell he's you not a that's traitor. that's wrong, that's and wrong. you're foolish to think that way. Yeah, he's not. He's never going to be a traitor. And then here's Volta, like saying, "I will free you from excess wrath and, and every." And Volta throws on watches from there. And trust me, we're going to have a, more betrayers, and it's not going to be yeah. there's on at all. And then the end of Salvation Four. Yay! Yeah. Yeah. Really ship. Dun 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 dun. dun. And so, and stay we, tuned, because uh, Salvation 5 is underway. Yep, I mean, there's me. I did all the most work and, and co-produced by you. You said you'd put choreographer on there. What? But you didn't. No. Oh. I mean, I choreographed, like, the entire fight. That's true. Right. Oh, there's you. Oh, there there's Kyler Nuba 135 as Lax. There's Champot Animations. Whoops, sorry, buddy. As the Kelgar and the Jatter Gear as Thurzon and the Nickel Lord as Nulez. Salvation good. 5, Bounty Hunters. Very good. Coming soon. And, well, everyone, thanks for watching, and we'll see you later.